Hi everyone, in this video we are going to take a look at this physics book. It is called Fun with Maths and Physics and it was written by Y. Perelman and it was published by Mir Publishers Moscow. This used to be a publishing company in Soviet era Russia and what they would do is they would take old or rather they would take Russian books and translate them to other languages. They are old now uh, but they weren't old back then. They were the current books that were being um, produced and published uh, at the time in Russia. And so there's translations of these books all over the world. Uh, I have some in English, I have some in Spanish. And this is cool. Let's just open this book up and take a look inside it. This is supposed to be a very, very famous uh, Russian book. So if you know about it, uh, leave a comment in the comment section. It's like it's supposed to be kind of legendary. The fact that it was reprinted says a lot. Uh, the fact that it was, you know, translated rather by mere publishers says a lot, I think, about, you know, the quality of the book. It's hard to read there. Let me see if I can zoom in just a little bit more. There we go. In 1913, in Romanian bookshops appeared a book by the outstanding educational, I think it says educationalist, Yakov Zadrak Perelman entitled Physics for Entertainment. I actually have that book. Mm -hmm. It struck the fancy of the young who found it in it the answers to many of the questions that interested them. Yeah, it's a little hard to read there, so let's keep going, but let's see what else we have. Fun with math and physics, brain teasers, tricks, illusions. Yeah, they didn't pick the best color uh, for that, and so I have a hard time uh, with the distance that I am <laughs> and the way it shows up on the camera. Not the best colors for the intro. 84, okay, contents. Let's see here, what else we have here? Oh, wow, wow, look at this. This is cool for young physicists. Uh, if I can find any copies of this book, I'll leave a, a link in the description. I, I don't know if I'll be able to. These books are really um, hard to find. Problems on manual words. There's a lot of pictures here. I think these are diagrams for later in the book. I have not read the entire book. I've only looked at small portions of it. So um, this is one I've had for a while. Pretty cool, right? There's a couple more pictures. And then when we get to the end of the pictures, the, the book actually starts. I think these are for like the projects and stuff. See scissors and paper. See, they give you some, some little things that you can do. Yeah, it's fun. So it's, a, it's supposed to be a, like a project book, you know, uh, for physics. So, and I, I think for its time, uh, it was pretty pretty epic. I'm gonna give it a whiff here because I haven't done that, so I just need to feel like I should. No, no, not a gut. No, not 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 doing it again. Mm -mm. <laughs> Anyways, take care.